it is a general reading this may or may not resonate okay if it doesn't check out your other placements if you need a personal reading all that information is going to be below someone's leaving a long-term commitment someone's leaving a marriage or a relationship and this is happening because someone's finding new love somewhere definitely looks like someone's leaving a relationship if not um there's a lot of instability and insecurity in a relationship okay you're just not being able to reach a certain level of security and stability in your relationship in the near future something's ended here currently we have the world and what is influencing the world is the devil okay someone's because someone was feeling restricted feeling bound restricted or there was just a lot of unhealthy attachment to something or someone has an unhealthy attachment to someone that's why they're ending things with another person on your mind is the five of wands in reverse you want nothing to do with a competitive situation or you're just not fighting for something anymore okay you want a peaceful resolution or this is just someone who's just withdrawing from competition like you know what i don't want to fight anymore or this is just someone who's not conflicted in their head anymore they're pretty clear because in the ace of swords the reverse in reverse was in the past there was a lot of confusion they could have been lies or there could have been someone who's just not clear about what they want okay but i think by ending the situation there is a lot of clarity all right let's clarify clarify the okay let's see the overall energy wow leo you showed up see ace of swords in reverse lack of clarity a lot of confusion the sun overall energy is now things are clear brighter days ahead okay you have clarity about a situation things are not in the dark anymore brighter days coming in this is happiness being very very optimistic and uh, growth expansion whatever have you okay you're happy right now something's made you happy and what's made you happy is probably ending a situation which was very very toxic for you clarify okay all right let's clarify clarify the sun why is the sun here as the overall energy for leo clarify the sun please clarify the sun yeah definitely i mean i definitely it definitely looks like a divorce to me the justice in reverse could be dealing with a libra the justice in reverse could be a divorce or it could be someone who felt that things were not balanced they, there was no equal give and take there was no fairness in a situation someone could have felt cheated someone felt they didn't get what they deserve clarify for the justice in reverse please what is this justice in reverse Clarify the justice in reverse. We have the eight of pentacles. Clarify the justice in reverse. So now, because someone's leaving a situation, and now they're focused on something else. I. Eight of Pentacles in reverse to me is someone putting in the effort, okay, making the effort to do something, all right? Or maybe someone realized that they were unfair to the other person and now they want to rectify a situation. But the justice is still in reverse. The justice upright is rectifying the situation. The justice in reverse is just being unfair, okay? So maybe someone was being unfair and now there's and the other person, probably you are focused on your work. You're focused on building for yourself. You're focused on doing the best for yourself, okay? Try for the Eight of Pentacles. Try for the Eight of Pentacles. Maybe you want to... Okay, right. See? Someone's being single. Someone's getting out of a relationship. 100%. For sure. Divorce. If this is not you, if it's not you, then this is not your reading. Click out now. You have clarity about a situation that you had a lot of confusion about. You're getting a divorce. Someone's definitely leaving, ending a contract, marriage, whatever, long-term commitment because they're very focused on their themselves. They're making the effort to work on themselves and someone's getting single. Someone's getting out of a relationship. Nine of Pentacles is someone focused on their money, focused on themselves. This is someone who's like, you know, I am enough, okay? This person doesn't need anyone, all right? They're very okay on their own. And uh, this is someone who realizes their value, their worth, okay? So, yeah, someone's definitely realizing what they are worth and they're not taking anything for less. Can I put the Ace of Swords in reverse? Yeah, because there was no clarity. Maybe someone was a liar. There was a lot of confusion. We have the clarifier, but the Queen of Swords in reverse. Someone got cut out. 
and someone's pissed off now. Try for the Queen of Swords in reverse. Queen of Swords in reverse is someone very, very bitchy. She's pissed off. She's angry. Fly for the Queen of Swords in reverse. Could be dealing with an air sign. Of course, Libra, Gemini. Fly for the Queen of Swords in reverse. Don't have any cards, but I'm going to take this. Page of Swords in reverse. Again, more lies. Page of Swords in reverse is someone A, absolutely immature in communication. B, this is someone who holds back information. Okay, They're spying, they're stalking, they know whatever is going on, but they're just not going to talk. Okay, I know this energy. It's a very shitty communicator. Okay, I hate this energy because I have people like this around me and I know how it feels. Okay, This is someone who will just keep quiet and watch the show. A lot of mind games. Okay, whoever this person is or whoever got cut out, they were playing a lot of mind games. All right. You definitely cut someone out. And now we have the five of pentacles in reverse. I didn't even ask for a clarification. This just came out. Whoever you cut out, Leo, now they want to return back to you. So someone someone returned back in the past. We have the five of pentacles in reverse. Whoever you left out in the cold, someone returned back. Okay. Whoever was cut out, they came back. Whoever was playing mind games came back. All right. Clarify the world. Why is the world here as the current situation for Leo? Why is the world here as the current situation for Leo? Clarify the world. Yeah, you're ending things. You're bossing up. You're the emperor. Could be dealing with an Aries or I have Aries in your boat trap. So you're ending a situation. You're closing a chapter and bringing a new one and you're bringing a new one by bossing up. Okay, you're taking control of a situation. You're going to bring a lot of order and stability to the situation. Okay, that's how you want to move forward starting a new chapter. That's a lot of control. That's a lot of um, you know, like a lot of structure to a situation, okay? Where if things were out of control, you're finally regaining control of your situation or yourself. Clear for this. We have another person. We have to, we have a call card here, King of Swords. You are extremely, extremely clear about what you want. You know what you want. But with the Emperor, you're thinking from your logic. Your emotions are on the side. King of Swords, more logic, more no emotions, okay? You're going to your approach towards ending this situation is super, super clear and super logical, okay? You're not going to let any emotions affect you, okay? Clarify for the King of Swords. Clarify for the King of Swords, please. Clarify for the King of Swords. Clarify for the King of Swords. The, with the world, you could be living at a distance from this person. Clarify for the King of Swords. Clarify for the King of Swords. Yeah. And now you're just going to chill. You're going to have fun. You're going to just do what makes you happy. You're celebrating. You're going out, dating, chilling, having fun, doing what makes you happy. You're just going to have a good time with your friends. Clarify the devil, please. Why is the devil influencing the situation? Why is the devil influencing the situation? The devil is unhealthy attachment. Could be dealing with a Capricorn, okay? This is a lot of toxicity toxicity in a situation or coming from a person all right you may feel that you could have felt very tight and bound and restricted to this person okay a lot of fear a lot of negativity unhealthy attachment is what i'm feeling here clarify the devil clarify the devil please this is a very toxic situation that you ended clarify the devil yeah this was an unhealthy situation in a marriage the four of wands this marriage was unhealthy it was toxic you couldn't take it anymore. Maybe this was just one person just giving in or there was just someone who was absolute a liar, a cheater, whatever. All right. But this was something that you were not happy with. You were definitely not happy with. Clarify for the Four of Wands. What is this Four of Wands? Four of Wands is a marriage card. Okay. Clarify for the Four of Wands. Clarify for the Four of Wands. And now you're moving towards new love. You're, or you're just choosing to love yourself. You're choosing to love yourself first. I'm getting a lot of I choose myself, okay? Either this is new love or this is more like I choose myself first, okay? I don't think there is new love here. Like I said again, this is choosing to love yourself first. I love, you know, like I am enough. I don't need anyone. This is caring about yourself. Clap for the Ace of Cups. Clap for the Ace of Cups. You realize your value because with the Nine of Pentacles, this is someone who realizes their worth, their value. They know they don't need anyone. She's not clingy. She's not needy. She's okay on her own. Absolutely okay. She's got the money. She's got the looks. She's got everything that she needs. Apply for the Ace of Cups here. Yeah. Apply for the Ace of Cups. Apply for the Ace of Cups. Yeah. 
But Queen of Cups and Rose, we have someone who's emotionally very, very cold. Again, I see this person, whoever's the Emperor and King of Swords, who's thinking from their logic, this is the same person. Someone's hurt. Queen of Cups and Rose, Water Sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Someone's very hurt. They're emotionally unavailable, emotionally very, very cold. They're just loving themselves. Someone's loving themselves and very close off to this connection. Why is the Five of Wands in reverse here? Why is the Five of Wands in reverse on Leo's mind? Clarify for the Five of Wands in reverse. Clarify for the Five of Wands in reverse. Yeah, you want nothing to do with conflict. And now you're manifesting a new direction. We have the Three of Wands here. You're not even looking into whatever shit you came out from. The situation that you've ended, you've ended it. You're not even looking at it anymore. You're manifesting a new direction. You want to look at something else. You want to look at what's out there because you're sick and tired. You're fed up of this long-term commitment or marriage that you were in okay it, it, brought you, it brought you nothing but toxicity clap for the three of wands clap for the three of wands clap for the three of wands because you're fed up nine of nine of wands in reverse you're tired beaten nine of wands in reverse is the wounded warrior okay but you're not even giving it a lost shot you're done this is more like enough is enough i am done I get a lot of I'm done energy. I love myself first. I'm going to take care of myself first. I'm going to see what makes me happy. I've given enough to this relationship. And you know what? You're out. You're out. Nine of Wands in reverse is someone who's giving up. Okay. They're not even wanting to fight anymore. Yes, it does mean that your guards are out. But out here, I feel you're fed up. Like this is it. This was the last of what I had. Fly for the Nine of Wands in reverse. Fly for the Nine of Wands in reverse. Look, you want to move ahead successfully, but this is without this person. You want to move ahead. You want forward movement. You're moving forward, 100%. You're moving forward. This is not with this person, for sure. Okay. You want nothing to do with the situation that has a lot that you have that that is that you have to compete for or that is very competitive. Okay. You're not fighting anymore. You're. You, it's like more like you're avoiding a lot of conflicts and arguments. Like you know what. Let's avoid this. Let, let me go in a different direction. I'm fed up. I'm tired. And I'm just going to move on successfully. Okay. Forward moment. You're moving forward. You're done with this person. Why the Ace of Cups here? Plus the Ace of Cups. The Two of Cups in reverse just popped out. If you guys could have seen that. Plus for the Ace of Cups in reverse. Plus for the Ace of Cups. Plus the Ace of Cups here. Plus for the Ace of Cups. You're moving forward towards your stability. We are the king of pentacles here. Earth energy, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. You're loving yourself and you're moving towards your stability, your growth. You're building for yourself. You could be focused on your money. You could just be focused on yourself. Like I said again, this entire reading gives you more luck. Cancer, you're focused. Uh, Leo, I'm sorry. Why did I say cancer? You could be dealing with a cancer. Leo, you're too focused on yourself, your money, your career, yourself. Your growth, your stability, your security, okay? And that's where you're finding your newfound love. That's what you're doing. I find a lot of focused on me, you know? Like, clarify the King of Pentacles. The King of Pentacles is extremely stubborn. Also, they're extremely focused. Clarify the King of Pentacles. Clarify the King of Pentacles. Clarify the King of Pentacles, please. Look, you're building. You're building with someone. You're building, this is, a uh, you know what, I think you're focused on work. The Three of Pentacles is a work situation. The Three of Pentacles is a work situation. You're focused on yourself. You're focused on work. You're focused on building your foundation, okay? It could be with people at work, okay? Clap for the Three of Pentacles. 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 But there is someone here out here. We have the death in reverse. That's scorpionic energy. There's someone here who's on the verge of making a big change, but they're still resisting it. So, so, so one person wants to leave this uh, long-term commitment or marriage, but there's one person here who is not wanting this change, okay? There is someone who's constantly repeating negative patterns, okay? Over and over again. They're doing the same thing over and over again. They know it doesn't serve them. They know it's not good for them. They know there's a death situation, but they're still dragging a dead horse, okay? There's someone here who is resisting and ending to a situation. You've ended it, okay? With the current situation as the world, you've ended things. But there's someone here who's still resisting and ending to something or still resisting a change, okay? Big changes, resisting, resisting big changes. Clap for the Ten of Pentacles in Reverse. Why will Leo experience the Ten of Pentacles in Reverse in the future? 
apply for the ten of pentacles in reverse yeah you're leaving a marriage a commitment and you're starting off new you have a brand new practical beginning coming up all right this is a small seed a gift from the universe it nurtured very very well it has the potential to grow very very big apply for the ace of pentacles apply for the ace of pentacles what is the ace of pentacles apply for the ace of pentacles However, you're going to have to fight for this. I'm getting you're going to have to fight for this because there's going to be a lot of competition. There could be a lot of people or probably there are people uh, who are not on the same page with you. Uh, ego clashes, uh, clashing personalities, people not on the same page, arguments, conflicts. But yeah, if you want this beginning, this is what you're going to be up for. Play for the five of wands. Play for the five of wands. Play for the five of wands, please. Please stand for the five of wands. Again, there's going to be the sun in reverse again, Leo. You showed up. The sun is in reverse. There could be kids involved before you... The, look, you want to leave this relationship. You want a practical new beginning, but it's not going to be easy with the five of wands, okay? There are chances that there are kids involved, and that's why you can't move forward. The sun in reverse is kids involved, or it could be uh, a lot of confusion, but still things are not clear, okay? Things are not out in the open. There's, again, a lot of confusion and uh, a lot of things that you'll still have to see. It's not going to be easy leaving, getting this new practical beginning, okay? Fly for the sun in reverse. 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 Yeah, but you're going to be extremely, extremely clear about what you want. The two swords in reverse air energy, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. You, you could have been ignoring or avoiding a situation or you could have been avoiding to see some clarity with the blindfold on. But you know what? You're going to get rid of this confusion. With the two of swords in reverse, you're making a decision. You know that you're going to be having to make you you could have want, ha, have had to make a decision between two unpleasant choices but you know what you don't have the blindfold all anymore in the future you're going to see things very very clearly see things for what it is and you're if you're if the communication is locked if you're not talking you're going to be very very decisive you're going to make a choice you're 100 percent going to make a choice okay see ace of swords in reverse at the bottom of the deck that's a lot of confusion, okay? It's not confusion, that's just a lack of clarity, miscommunication or misinformation or something like that, okay? Th there has to be a lot of clarity here, okay? With the sun card, with, uh, uh, you know, ace of swords in the reverse in the past, there is no clarity, okay? Or there's just someone who's lying, okay? Ace of swords in reverse can also be a liar. Or this could just be ace of swords in reverse to me can also be in two people who are completely contradictory in their beliefs okay so like i said one person wants to leave the situation and the other doesn't want to okay so yeah it's like a push and pull you know it's like a tug of war tug of war going on but yeah the overall energy is someone wants to be single and that's what i see someone will be single because they're leaving a marriage or a commitment okay it's just that you want this practical new beginning you've got to go through a lot of issues okay there's going to be a lot of fighting, a lot of conflicts. You're going to have to face it. It's going to make you unhappy for a very long time. You're going to be pessimistic about it. Like, you know what? Fuck it. It's never happening. There is a delay. There is a delay. But the moment you start seeing things clearly, I think that's when things are going to click for you. Yeah? You're going to have to make a very difficult choice. But yeah, it's going to be the best for you. Two of Swords in Reverse is making a choice between two difficult options. All right? You're going to make a choice. You're going to see things clearly. You're going to make a very... Um, again, I see a lot of logic here. I don't see anyone who's emotions, emotional here, okay? Whoever's making the choice to leave the relationship is very has a very logical approach here, okay? Rather than an emotional approach. Two of Swords is also, again, thinking from logic, all right? No emotions involved. A very detached choice. All right, Leo, I hope you enjoyed this reading. I hope this resonates with you. Please like, share, follow, subscribe. Leave your comments below. I'd love to read them. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.